In 1964, researchers at MIT began developing a revolutionary computer program that aimed to enable seamless communication between humans and machines. This ultimately led to the creation of ELISA, an early chatbot that was released in 1966. ELISA simulates the sort of conversation that you might have with a psychiatrist. Pretend that you have some psychiatric problem. Type it in and see what happens. I'm depressed. One of the key features that made Eliza stand out was its ability to respond to keywords in user input, making it feel like the chatbot truly understood the user or human. This laid the foundation for future chatbots such as Alice and Smarter Child in 1995 and 2001. However, it wasn't until a decade later that AI chatbots like Amazon Alexa, Google Now, and Siri truly took the world by storm. Alexa मुझे नॉनस्टिक कढ़ाई दिखाना। One moment. Hi Amy, how can I help? You just ask it what you need. Okay Google, what do I have to do today? We have a flat tire. How do I tie a bow tie again? What's the fastest way to Hartford Hospital? But in November 2022, OpenAI, an artificial intelligence research firm, introduced ChatGPT, an advanced chatbot powered by AI. that has generated crazy interest and excitement in the world when well, in the last few weeks it has become a rage and more and more people are wanting to know what this chat gpt all about and after exploring it a lot in the last few days i want to tell you all about it in fact just yesterday chat gpt cleared mba exam set by wharton professor this is insane honestly it is a crazy crazy technology and it's just mind blowing If you haven't heard of ChatGPT yet or if you already know what it is, this video is for you as I will talk about what all you can do with this crazily amazing AI technology and my experience with it. So let's understand what ChatGPT is. To understand its capabilities, I visited its website and asked a few questions. But now you might ask, this is not new and all existing chatbots like Siri, Google Assistant and Alexa can also do this. So what makes ChatGPT so special? Well, Siri, Google Assistant and Alexa can interact with the physical world and complete actions like open apps, take a note, book a table. ChatGPT can't do any of that. Instead, it is designed to provide more detailed and comprehensive answers. For example, it can write an essay, something that other chatbots cannot do. ChatGPT is a powerful language model developed by OpenAI. which has been widely adopted by developers and businesses to generate human like text for various applications this is made possible by its use of generative pre-trained transformer architecture a type of neural network that was introduced in 2017 in a paper titled attention is all you need a neural network is a large network of computers that can fine tune its output based on the feedback given to it during stages of training This allows the model to better understand the context and meaning of the input and to generate conversational response. As the name says, it's just like a chat system but very powerful and intelligent system. It is totally conversational like I started with just typing in basic questions and it was awesome to read the answers. ChatGPT is a pre-train that uses deep learning to generate human-like text. This allows the model to better understand the context and meaning of the input. and to generate conversational response it can be used to write articles stories and even poetry it is trained on massive data set of text from the internet about billions of words which allows it to understand and respond to a wide range of topics and questions i asked a bunch of questions from sports to history to science and i was impressed with the accuracy of this system and this was just the beginning I tried to stretch the system so I asked ChatGPT I am thinking of starting a business of dropshipping do you have any ideas and it gave me whole idea of what it is how to do it and what should I keep in mind I was super impressed with the quality of ideas next I thought of writing a creative story plot and within a few seconds it wrote a brilliant story for me So one of the most interesting use cases of ChatGPT is to use it as a creative tool 
where it can be used to generate new and interesting ideas. ChatGPT can also be used to generate new story plots, character descriptions, or even product ideas. This is crazy. Next, I asked ChatGPT to write a book summary. And again, within few seconds, I had my answer. More and more businesses are using this to quickly scan large amounts of customer feedback on news articles for relevant information. And a lot of students are using this for their homeworks, like writing a summary of a book. It is pretty accurate at almost everything. I actually went further and asked ChatGPT to write an essay in philosophy in tone of Socrates about current world order. Well, it was about an essay, then in philosophy, and then in Socrates tone, this is really a complex writing. But again, it just took few seconds to generate the response. Crazy. And I then asked it to grade it. So basically grading an essay written by ChatGPT itself. And again, within seconds, it gave me comprehensive review of the essay. This implies that it can be used to develop chatbots that converse with students naturally and humanly in academic code. However, ChatGPT's ability to produce responses that sound like human speech has raised concerns among educators, particularly when it comes to written assignments. They worry that the chatbot could be used to plagiarize essays that are hard to detect for the teachers. As a result, the New York City Education Department recently banned the use of ChatGPT in its public schools. Now, it's important to note that like any natural processing model, ChatGPT has limitations related to the caliber and volume of the training data. If the model is not trained on a representative and diverse data set, it may not produce reliable answers to all the queries. But still, it is super awesome. Overall, ChatGPT and AI systems have become reality. What we used to see in the movies in the 90s and thought the reality is too far, well actually, we are starting to live that reality.